Hi, I'm Chris Wilkinson, and I work on the development team for the Enterprise OSGI feature inside IBM's WebSphere application server. In this video, I'm going to walk through some of the new Enterprise OSGI features that IBM has delivered in the new WebSphere application server version 8 beta. This beta is available from March 2011. In 2010, IBM delivered the OSGI and JPA feature pack for WAS version 7. This was IBM's initial enterprise OSGI offering and it enabled users to develop applications that used OSGI as their core infrastructure. The feature pack was based on the Apache Ares open source specifications and the Enterprise Bundle Archive Model, or EBA, was the unit of encapsulation for an Enterprise OSGI application. With the introduction of the WebSphere Application Server version 8 beta, IBM has expanded on the initial offering to provide support for a host of new Enterprise OSGI features. Let's now take a look at some of these OSGI highlights in the beta deliverable. So here's a rundown of some of the new features in the WAS version 8 beta. One of the main areas of new support in the WAS 8 beta is the area of Servit 3.0. Uh, we now have full 3.0 support for web application bundles and this includes annotation scanning and web fragments. Another area of additional support is that relating to composite bundle archives. These are otherwise known as CBAs. In the WAS 7 feature pack, a CBA effectively acted as a zip file for a collection of bundles. There is additional support in version 8 so that a CBA can now appear as content inside an EBA. We have full administrative support for CBAs and we have a separate piece of functionality which allows you to import a zip file which contains a collection of bundles. EBA application update is an addition in version 8 beta. This functionality allows you to update on a bundle by bundle basis the contents of an application. This update is known as in place and it does not require the restart of the application. In addition to update the ability to extend your application is also supported. This extension is provided via the means of a CBA. Again, this is done in place and it is not necessary to restart your application for the extension to be effective. In the version 8 beta deliverable, we allow post-deploy configuration of EBA applications. Again, this is done in place and it is not necessary to restart the application for configuration changes to take place. Additional session management configuration is also available. We now allow you to configure session management information at the web application bundle level. Additional support has been added for performance monitoring and statistics of your applications. Built-in instrumentation provides the ability to monitor your applications. This can be done for such entities as web application bundles or blueprint bundles. Finally, additional security support has been added to allow you to configure run as security roles for your applications. That concludes our brief tour of the OSGI highlights 
in the WebSphere application server version 8 beta. For further and more detailed information on some of these new features, be sure to check out some of the other videos on this YouTube channel.